Hello, wonderful people. I welcome you once again to Auntie Shelley's Kitchen. And on this episode, we are making Gary Eba with steamed tilapia. Eh, a color sunny. So this is the tilapia that I'll be using for this whole process. So I started off by cleaning the tilapia because I do not want to see those things while cooking it. So in the process of washing, you can either use lemon or vinegar to wash. I added two tablespoons of vinegar, but I forgot to shoot, so pardon me. I transferred the tilapia into my cooking pot, added chopped onions and blended habanero peppers, one seasoning cube and some local salt to taste. So as I was adding the water, I remembered that I have left something out and that was my blended ginger and garlic mix guys so i added and i stirred everything well to combine and then i covered it to cook for like 20 minutes on a medium heat and guys it was ready so we are coming to pour the shito <laughs> way back growing up my auntie used to tell me that as a woman or a wife material there are some basic things you need to know and among them is a woman should be able to grind pepper in an everywhere bowl so to our future husband as a woman who do not know how to grind pepper in an everywhere bowl makes her feel less a wife material it's a question for another day <laughs> so in another cooking pot i added a pinch of salt so once the water started boiling i added in my gari and yellow gari so i started tying inside the gari and one chick gari <laughs> so here i added a little water to soften it and i tie inside uh, a new baby <laughs> So I kept mixing continuously because this is the consistency that I want. So guys, yeah, that is it. I added in my steamed tilapia and then my veggies also went in as well. And the almighty Gary Eba. Guys, I bet you this food is really delicious. So I hope you all tried this recipe at home. Thank you all for watching and I love you all.